good YouTube. Today we're going to be taking a look at the app library on the iPhone 12. The iPhone 12 comes shipped with iOS 14 and one of the new features of iOS 14 is the app library. So for those of you who don't know or who are experiencing iOS 14 for the first time with the iPhone 12, the app library is a new feature of iOS that Apple added on iOS 14 that helps organize your apps. It's an automatic organization of apps into categories that Apple has already predefined. The idea behind this setup is that it will help users manage and view their apps in a different format than they would normally get on the home screen. The actual app library's location is found when you swipe all the way left on your home screen. And there's a few ways you can reach this place. You can do it the normal way by just swiping through your home screen pages left until you reach the lap, app library. Or alternatively, you can slide your finger on the dots at the bottom of the home screen icons all the way to the right until you reach the very end and one more swipe will get you to the app library. Here you'll see at the top of the screen the app library search bar and the categories of apps organized into two by two squares. If you're looking for a specific app that you couldn't find on the home screen you can go ahead and type it in the app library and it should pop up fairly quickly. In the app library you can select the individual apps and scroll up and down to see all of your apps and all the categories. If you want to see all the apps in a given category, find a box with the four app bar at the bottom right and tap on the four app bar. Here all of the apps in the category will be presented to you and you can select the app as you choose. Having used an iPhone for a few generations and amassing a pretty large substantial collection of apps, I can see why Apple went down this route as it did become increasingly difficult to find the app I wanted at certain points in usage. With the app library, I have much faster access to a larger assortment of apps that I would normally normally be able to access as quickly using the quick launch feature at the bottom of my home screen. Another cool feature is that if you want a quick alphabetized list of all your apps, all you have to do is tap on the search bar. Here you'll get prompted to the right of the screen with an alphabet and you can quickly scroll up or down to see an alphabetized view of all of your apps. This is similar to the list view found on the Apple Watch and it's very useful for those apps that you rarely use but you might need from time to time. Previously, without the app library, you would have to try to dig it up on your home screen, but this way you can find it fairly quickly using either the search function or by finding the first letter of the app. Apple is really putting a lot of faith in this new format as it's included a few app library settings in the home screen settings. If you go into your settings and then the home screen option, you can choose to add newly downloaded apps only to your app library as opposed to your home screen. This is useful if you have a customized iOS 14 home screen that you've customized and gotten to just the way you like it and you don't want new apps to distort your customized home screen setup. Overall, I'm a fan of this app library as it really does jive with some of the new features and organizational implementations found in iOS 14. So what do you think? Do you like this new app layout that comes based with iOS 14 and the iPhone 12? Leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe. 